Hey guys, and welcome back to another exciting episode from the Vacaville iPhone King. This is B Double, and we are going to look at a launcher today. Um, just so you know, I am on Facebook. Um, just uh, search for this name that pops up on the screen right below me, around right now. Um, so, Ice Cream Sandwich is uh, going to be announced today and introduced to the public as well as the Nexus Prime. Um, still going to be a little ways out before we any of us are rocking this. So, I went ahead and found on the market the ICS launcher from Team Syndicate. And we're going to be checking that out today and seeing if uh, it's something you guys might want to give a shout out on. So, here it is. As you can see, we have an Evo 3D from Sprint here. And this is the phone that uh, the King is rocking right now. And uh, the phone I'm going to show you guys this launcher on. So, there's my standard Sense 3.0 lock screen. Let's go ahead and give that a swipe up. And this is your ICS launcher. Now, a couple of things... You might be asking yourself, where's the dock? Well, you still have it. It's down there. I just keep it empty because I like that look. Um, you do have your honeycomb buttons down below to bring up your page preview. A back key, which is hardly functional because most of the time it's not shown on screen. Um, and then, of course, your running apps carousel. Now, when you hit this, it brings up a message saying that it is not complete and I need to be patient. So, so far i found that the email, calendar, and music apps, as you can see, do not open and it gives us a forced close. Uh, I'm not sure why, but... Um, thinking I don't know so let me give you guys a little explanation of exactly what I have all on my screen I'm rocking the ICS launcher with a beautiful widget clock that's the super clock 4x1 and I've got the HD blue weather icon on that and the ice cream sandwich clock skin these are beautiful widgets toggles. We have a Google Plus. And using colorized widget, I have a scrollable G Reader. Now, one of the things about ICS, I'm going to tell you right now, uh, it does have a little bit of a scrolling bug on the uh, home screen. I can't seem to recreate it ever, but it happens. So I also have my music widget and a Facebook, Twitter, scrollable timeline, also courtesy of Colorize Widgets from Snowbee. Um, here we also have what I what is called animated widget contact. And it can be used as an app launcher, contact launcher, shortcut launcher, uh, whatever. We've got three of them. We've got news, photo, and apps. So if you tap on that, it instantly brings up the apps that are inside there. With a settings as well. Photo. News. So what else does ICS have? Well, it's got the uh, Google search widget up top that's stylized like your honeycomb. I really like that feature. I really like the two blue lines, period, on here. And let's take a look at our app drawer, shall we? This is the app drawer. Now, you can look at apps or go to place widgets or to the marketplace. It does have those links at the top. Now, 
for the most part, I have found really nice scrolling on this dock or app page. So the settings available for this launcher are very sparse. Um, I'm sorry to say. Hopefully they're going to be updating. I plan on getting the pro version just because they tend to update those more. So launcher settings pop up. This you get step one launch the settings panel and you've got a total of five wallpaper hack, live wallpaper support, hide icon labels, enable desktop bounce and enable hide notifications. So once you've clicked your settings, hit the back button and then apply. And of course, we get a force close. Gotta love it. Now this is new, all these force closes. Um, it's pretty new. And there is this there's the scrolling bug. So that's the ice cream sandwich launcher. Go ahead and pick it up. It's free in the market. Uh, it also comes with ice cream sandwich wallpapers, as you can see here. <coughs> you get a few. Let me just change that up to show you guys a more accurate rendition of ice cream sandwich with the default ice cream sandwich wallpaper here. Um, so you do get a choice of wallpapers. I believe there's ten. The last ones are kind of bootsy. The first two, pretty cool. So, what about your lock screen? How can you get a different looking lock screen to complement this ice cream sandwich? Well, I've recently found another new app and it is called Magic Locker. And we're going to go ahead and show you guys that as well real quick. Keep your eyes out for the full review on this app. So here you get Magic Locker and a Magic Locker settings. Um, so I'm going to tap that. Now with these themes, when you download a theme for Magic Locker, let's just start, let's just go ahead and download one, the Steve Jobs. Once you have downloaded it, it is not going to show up in the theme section of Magic Locker. It is installed, so let's go to my apps and we're gonna find that magic locker Steve Jobs should be right here so once you find that you're gonna have to open it and open it and click install and it's going to add the theme to your list here. So your settings, you get a wallpaper chooser, enable magic locker, and you can ena enable the menu button on the lock screen, which um, I don't really need until I tell you about this uh, super awesome. So just tap it and hit apply, and it's going to show you your lock screen, brand new. This is the Steve Jobs tribute theme with an iPhone swipe. So now uh, I got a really cool theme right here. And it was 
awesome and it was updated and after the update it does this it doesn't actually work anymore it won't unlock but you can see the gist of it you click that and you can go to your camera your phone your messages or your unlock so that's a honeycomb style but as you can see we have to change themes to be able to unlock so this is the one that I'm using now this is the Samsung Galaxy S theme and it does work you can unlock unlock the messages or unlock the phone or I should say call log but from the call log you can get pretty much anywhere within the phone application so that is how to ice cream sandwich up your phone a little bit ahead of Google's release um, don't forget to rate comment subscribe and check me out on Facebook here there's that uh, that name to search for right across the bottom of the screen again keep your eye out for launcher showdowns and more honeycomb helpers and more about the Iconia tab. Thanks for watching. I'm VVIK, and I'm out.